Welcome to the Daily Challenge for October 8th, 2014. Let's begin.
I was still in, I've got a, a weapon with a range of two mode. No, I have a glass shard in my hand with no handle that cuts myself every time I try to use it, because holding a glass shard is actually very painful, in case you didn't know. Yeah, that's why I almost didn't take the uh, glass repair. I was thinking, okay, with only one heart left, if I get hit, I'm probably dead, so I might as well just take the glass repair, right? Which is close to true, but it's not completely true, because I did have some armor. So, as you can see there, I actually took damage, but I did not die. Although, honestly, the hit might as well have killed me, because with only a glass shard to fight, you're not going to do too well. Alright, let's see how we did. Number 28, okay, not bad. It's about two and a half hours after the daily challenge ticked over. Yeah, it was an interesting run, so I tried to kill the shopkeeper again. Not sure if he noticed, because I completely failed at it. <laughs> I got the range of the bomb incorrect. I was trying to stay as far away from him as possible, but I stayed a little bit too far away, and then ended up with not enough bombs left to actually kill him. So, whoopsie. If I'd managed to get that off, I could have potentially gotten a blunderbuss. Which would have been freaking amazing. That is an amazing weapon. So it's a shame that didn't happen. Try to be better with my bomb aimings next time. And I'm trying to think of whether I actually prefer the blunderbuss or the titanium crossbow. I think I actually might prefer the titanium crossbow over the blunderbuss. I think it has a longer range. And it's certainly more directed less likely to just blow up everything in your path. Gives you more fine control over your shots. But at the same time, the blunderbuss is good for crowd control. So, I don't know. They're both pretty damn amazing. Anyway, that has been the daily challenge for October 8th, 2014. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.